Hi there, I'm Barry Mitchell of Barry's Web Design. What I want to show you today is um, website optimization and the results that I have achieved for um, a few of my clients over the years. I know, obviously, that a lot of companies around Dundee, Scotland, Arbroath, Perth, Forfar, wherever, promise that they are doing website optimization, but uh, they don't seem to be able to prove the results. So what I want to do today is I want to show you results that I have achieved and still do achieve for um, small businesses. My target market, of course, is the small business, as I am a small business as well. I um, achieve results myself in website organization and I achieve results for my clients as well. Anyway, let's crack on. So I have opened my um, Chrome browser here and I, you can see here it says using your uh, browsing as a guest. The reason I have myself browsing as a guest on the browser is because whenever I type in a search engine, a, a result into a non-guest browser, as an example on my phone or on my computer, Google, if I'm using Google, will track what I have typed in, then if I go to one of the websites that I've previously typed in, Google knows that. So when I go back and type in a, the term again, it will uh, manipulate my search engine results and show me the stuff that I it thinks I want to see again. So the results will change according to my browser usage. If I'm using a guest browser, as I'm doing right now, the results are totally original. These are like... Um, this is a brand new startup computer uh, a browser and the results are brand new. So whenever I type anything into the browser right now as a search result, a uh, search engine term or search term, the results will be what is seen the very first time someone t types that result in. So anyway, obviously the proof is in the pudding. So first of all, I am going to type in web designers in Dundee. Web designers Dundee. Now, I do website optimization for myself, like, all the time, right? And sometimes I do a lot of changes behind the scenes on my website and on the front end of my website as well. And I've been making quite a lot of changes to my website core since around about December last year, 2020. So my website rankings, my natural rankings have actually dropped. But I'm not concerned because of the optimization that I'm doing on my site is to ensure long-term results. So my website rankings will go up again very shortly, but right now they're not overly great. So anyway, I've typed in Web Designers Dundee. Let's see the results. Now you see this is the first time I've used this browser, so it's asking me to agree to the cookies as a guest. So I'm just gonna press agree, but we're not gonna type these things in again so the results will not fluctuate. I don't do pay-per-click most of the time. Um, I don't do pay-per-click for any local businesses. So I'm not gonna be concerned with the ad results here. See here it's got ad next to the result. I, I don't care about these results. Uh, so anyway, let's look at the results. So I've typed in Web Designers Dundee. Now, okay, so let's look at the top results for the NAP results, name, address, phone number results. There I am there. So I'm first for the NAP results. And what do we have here? We have Dundee Web Design Company. Uh, Dundee Web Design, rather, as that's called, and then Bluecoo, then Barry's Web Design. So just now, um, because I'm doing optimization, my um, results have fluctuated. I'm normally second or first. Anyway, uh, Dundee Web Design are first, uh, then Bluecoo, then Barry's Web Design, so I'm third. Still a good result. Then a AVA Media, uh, then Web Integrations, and so on. So that just shows you that I am on the first page, so I do know what I'm talking about when it comes to SEO. Now let's go and have a look at other people's results as well for um, some of my clients. So I make um, a website for a dog groomer in Dundee and they asked me to get them found for dog groomers in Dundee. So let's see what happens. Dog groomers Dundee. Right. None of them are my clients in the top results for the NAP results. Um, but... There's a Facebook result for Dapper Dogs. Then I make this website here, um, Casey's Grim Room. I, this is a new website, actually. I only made this website, I think it was last November, 
I made this website. So that's only, uh, what's it now, March, so December, March, it's only four months old, and already I've got it second on the search engines for Dog Groomers in Dundee, which um, is, is a good achievement, actually. Um, Dog Groomers in Dundee is quite a hard thing to be found for. So just to prove that, it's a, that it is the website that I have made, if I go to the the footer of the page, there is the link back to my website there. Barry's web design. Right, so anyway, the, you'll see on some of the examples I'm going to show you just now, uh, it says Web Designers Dundee, and that's my link there to my website, just to show you that I made the website. And obviously to show other people I made the website as well when they're visiting their uh, the company's pages. So let's type in quite another um, quite difficult term to get found for. Uh, painters and decorators. Dundee. Right. So I make none of these websites in the top three there in the NAP results, but I do make the Stephen Foley um, Stephen Foley Decorators website. So there you go again. That's uh, first this time. Let's press on that. The slideshow's loading. There we go. Pardon me. And so there's my link there. Web designers Dundee. If you look in the bottom left corner, you'll see it says um, HTTPS Barry's Web Design So there's no point clicking on that because it is obviously mine. Stephen obviously asked me to get him found for uh, Painters and Decorators Dundee, so I optimised the links into his website and the um, general content on the site for Painters and Decorators Dundee. And the result I have achieved is first. Now, okay, so let's look at another term. Um, let's go for um, Dent Repairs. Dent Repair. Dundee. Cool. Now, I said dent repairs there, not dent repair. But let's have a look at dent repair anyway. I could always change it in a minute. Right, so cool. So I make the Dunlop Coachworks website. And I also make the Auto Dents website. In fact, I'll just show you that. This is an old website. I made this website years ago. And um, I have been promising Brian that I will update his website very soon for free. But I've just been pretty busy doing other things. So I will get around to this very soon. Anyway, there's my link there. Barry's web design again. This website will be updated very shortly. As you can see, I made this website a long time ago. Uh, Auto Dents, I make their website as well. So that's one in the NAP results, one in the, um, that's first in the natural results and second in the top NAP results. And, um, oh, actually, I can see there, I also make the p &H Auto Refinishing Centers website as well. So let's just look at, uh, sorry, I don't want to go to Chips Away. I want to go to, uh, auto dents. Uh, there's my link there, Barry's web design. Well, it says web designers on D, but as you can see in the bottom left corner, it says Barry's web design. And on the PNH Auto Refinishing Centre's website. Also an old website, and I have been telling Jim that I'm going to be updating this website very soon as well. Uh, they, Brian and Jim, have been my long term clients for a long time, so I'm going to be updating their websites for free because they deserve it for being one of my long term clients. So anyway, that's three results, in fact. So people will, might type in repairs. So let's just change that, because I did say repairs. Right, Dunlop Coachworks is still there. And Auto Dents is there. And p and uh, Auto Refinishing Centre is also there as well. So that's three results for Dent Repairs Dundee, which is um, pretty good, if I do say so myself. Let's go and type in now uh, double um, glazing companies Dundee. As you see, Google is suggesting that, so it's obviously a result that um, people are, I've spelled that wrong, but um, Google will repair that for me. Uh, right, so double glazing companies in Dundee. I make none of these in the top three Claymore windows or Tayside windows or double glazing from Tabled, but um, I do make the Ancrum Windows website, so you can see that's another page one result in position one on the search engine rankings, so good for them. Uh, Paul <laughs> from Ancrum Windows uh, recently phoned me and says, um, Barry, is there any way we can get our uh, search engine rankings to go up a bit? I was like, cool, let's go and look at your search engine rankings right now. And he was in first, so you can't get a better first ball, unfortunately. If you can get first first, then I will achieve that for you. But right now, first is the best I can do. 
Anyway, uh, just to prove that website's mind, and there it is there, website designers done the and as you can see again in the bottom left corner of the browser it says Barry's Anyway, let's crack on with another result. Um, let's go with um, landscape companies. Uh, landscaping. Spell that correctly. Landscape Gardeners Dundee. Right, so Landscape Gardeners Dundee is a really hard term to be found for um, because there's loads of them. It's a popular term, so it is quite a strong term um, and a lot of people want to be found for that. Obviously, because there's a lot of landscape gardeners um, around about Tayside that want to target Dundee. So anyway, um, Jim, the Garden Landscape Company, obviously asked me to um, get him found for landscape gardeners in Dundee. And I've done that. There it is there. Uh, the, landscape, the Garden Landscape Company at Dundee, which is Jim's result. There, we'll just press the website. There it is there. And also, I've got him first. His domain name is orangegardens.co.uk. Um, the reason it's orangegardens.co.uk is because... <laughs> Um, another website designer in Dundee around about, I can't remember, it must be over 10 years ago, told Jim that it would be a good idea to buy the domain name Orange Gardens because um, it's, I think they said it was an obscure term that people will type in to find his company. No, if they want to find Orange Gardens, they'll type in Orange Gardens. But anyway, um, with that in mind, I totally ignored that advice and uh, started doing actual optimization for his company. And he is obviously at the top of the search engines there for uh, the Garden Landscape Company is Dundee. And he's in the first results on the NAP results as well. So that's two first results for the term Landscape Gardeners Dundee. Um, you cannot get better than that. So, if, like I say, if you're looking for optimization, you can see by these results that I am achieving the top end results. A lot of people are saying they're doing optimization, but as you can see, the proof is in the pudding. And I am actually achieving the results. So, anyway, let's go with another term. Um, let's go with, let's type in um, sign makers, Dundee. Right, this is now another very difficult term to be found for. Um, the reason it's a difficult term to be found for is because sign makers are in high demand. So they um, are willing to pile quite a lot of money into their websites to get designed. Um, I personally, my ethics will uh, not allow me to sell people stuff they don't need so i much prefer to keep my clients for a long long time so i'm going to charge like um, pretty standard fees for website design and for optimization i charge a, like a fixed fee per month for website optimization which is part of my packages so i don't charge an optimization fee as such i just charge for the the website and I do optimization as well inside the service. Anyway, uh, I'll stop babbling on. Uh, anyway, I make the website for Morcant Designs there. And what else have we got on the page? I also make the website for Duncan Signs. And there is, so I've got three results on the homepage of Google for a seriously desirable term, which is Sign Makers Dundee. So I've got Morcant Designs and Duncan Signs and at the top of the NAP results is also Morcant Designs as well. So there you go, that's uh, three results on that page for, for that term. Um, let's look for um, wool shops in Dundee. Wool shops. Right, so that's quite a tight term as well, in fact, because wool is obviously very very popular so for people that do knitting <laughs> obviously um anyway the results here are i make the website for Wheelcraft, betty's Wheelcraft in dundee so as you can see there i've got the Wheelcraft at the top of the nap results and Wheelcraft are first for um wheel shops dundee so her website is an e-commerce community sort of website um it's more about bringing the people into the shop than it is about selling the stuff online. Um, so while the shop is an e-commerce shop, it's mo mostly for uh, the term uh, Wheel Shops Dundee. And according to the statistics that I see privately, she is getting a lot of hits 
to that um, website for wool shops in Dundee. People are typing that in hundreds of times a day from across Dundee, so that is a, that is a hard term to be found for as well. Anyway, uh, so as you can see there, I've got first for British Wool Shop, uh, British Wool Craft there, and first on the NAP results as well. So another, um, if you own or are the manager of an office in Dundee or a business, you need to get part testing done for your company. Part testing is um, testing the electrical equipment like the Hoover, the kettle, all these kind of things in your business. So you need a part testing done. So let's type in uh, part testing. Part testing Dundee. Cool. So, um, what do I make the website for here? I make the website for none of the adverts, obviously. I make the website for safety electrical testing. Safety electrical testing. So another um, first page result there. That's good. Uh, let's try another term. Um, daycare. Daycare. Nurseries. Daycare nurseries. Nurseries. Dundee. If you're one of my current clients, um, <laughs> you will know um, that I've got an issue with spelling and occasionally do leave spell mistakes on websites. It's um, a human being, so that's just the way it goes. But that's that's no why we're looking at this right now. Anyway, so there we go. Dick and Nursery Dundee. Let's see what we've got here. I make the website for JoJo's Nursery. There. Dick and Nursery Dundee. I want to change it to Nurseries, actually, because people type in um, the plural of things, not the singular. So, anyway, I've typed in daycare nursery. Google is trying to correct me. That is how you spell nurseries. Um, Google, 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 <laughs> Google is trying to correct me to type in nursery Dundee, but people will type in nurseries. It's as simple as that. Anyway, I'm making the website for uh, JoJo's Nursery. So, on JoJo's Nursery, I um, provided everything for this website. I provided all of the photography. Took a picture of that wee guy underneath that table there. Took a picture of them. I also also done the virtual tours, done all of the design. I never designed the logo though. Uh, pretty cool logo, but I never designed it. So anyway, you can see my link in the bottom corner there, uh, Barry's web design. Also done um, the um, virtual tours as well. Um, let's see, can we see? That's not what I want to see. I want to see a virtual tour. There. I'm also an official Google photographer as well. Uh, official Google Street View photographer. So I done the virtual tours for this website as well. So cool. They want to be found for Daycare Nurseries Dundee, and obviously, um, you can see that I've achieved that. They're third on the NAP results there. This is a this is a really hard term to be found for as well. Um, I used to make the website actually for um, another nursery in Dundee um, years ago. They dominated the search engines for years. Um, strangely, JoJo's Nursery is in the same place that I used to be, uh, not in the search engines. Um, anyway, for Daycare Nurseries, JoJo's Nurseries is on the first page in the results and at the top. So good for them. Anyway, um, that's pretty much it. That's all I want to say. I was want to, I just want to say that if you're looking for optimization in Dundee, website optimization in Dundee, um, feel free to give me a call. 01382 525896. Um, as you can see from the results, I do do website optimization. Like I say, a lot of other people are saying they do website optimization, but what they do is sell paper click and black hat, what's called black hat optimization. I do white hat optimization. I optimize the websites and um the results so um you will get found in the long term results is what people are actually looking for there's no there's really no point in having um a quick fix so like a lot of people um a lot of website optimization companies will say to you we will optimize your website for xyz they will achieve that and three or four months down the line your website will be removed from the search engine results because they are doing what's called black hat optimization. So you really need to question the person that's doing the optimization to see how they're doing it. Um, because you need to do white hat optimization or you will get banned off the search engines. Anyway, if you're needing any optimization done to your website, feel free to get in touch. My phone number is 01382 525 896. Or you can go to my website at barryswebdesign.co.uk. Okay, thanks for watching.